Hi, boys and girls, it's Miss Kelly, and we're going to have our first lesson together online. Today, we're going to talk about a brand new letter. So first off, let's make sure that remember all that we remember all of the letters we've learned so far. Just like we do when we're in our classroom, we're going to look at our chart and we're going to say the name of all the vowels and practice their sounds. So we see the A, A says A, 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 as in E says E, 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 as in elephant. Right. I says I, 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 as in inchworm. Remember, we think about that inchworm going up and down, inchworm. And O is one of our easiest letters. O says ah, 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 as in ostrich. And the U makes us think of going up, ah, 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 like open up the umbrella. Now let's move to our consonant. Take our vowels off, and there's our consonant chart. T, just push off your tongue, t, 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 as in table. And L, put your tongue behind your teeth. O, O, lamp, o, lamp, o, lamp. B, we like the B. B, we use our lips and we think about. Big Ben's Bell. Big Ben's Bell. We always say the end is kind of grumpy because you have to scrunch up your nose and push down. Mm, 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 as in neff. Neff. But the M, we get to be sweet again. M says mmm, 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 as in neff. And then last week, when we were in school together, we had our new letter H. And we found out that H is a nice, soft sound. You can feel your breath on your hand. As in horse, hand, hot. As in horse. And last week, we even met Henrietta Hinn. She was on our blend ladder. And Henrietta was helping us to read the H blends. Let's see if we can remember how to do that. Okay, we just put those two letter sounds together and we make a blend. Ah, ha, eh, ha, eh, ah, ha, ah. Ha. So putting those two sounds together turns it into a blend and we can say it a little bit quicker. Ha. 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 Exactly right. And here you go last week. We even made some three letter words on the back of Henrietta Hen's Lynn ladder. And we still have those words right here. The first one we made last week was eh, mm. we added an N, hen, H O, ha. But we added a T to make a word. Ha, t, hot, uh, mm. hum. Hum, and then the H I, 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 and what did that turn into? Hi, mm. when we added that M, him, 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 and our last one was H A. That's right, ha, and we added an easy letter T to the end. Hat, hat. So we made three letter words with our H blends. Now we're gonna move on to a new letter. This letter for this week is gonna be a curvy letter. It's gonna be the letter S, S, S. And S 
kind of sounds like a snake. You can hear the S, like a slithering sound. S says as in sun. What else do we have for S? I have a whole stack of things for S right here. Let's see, capital S, capital S. This is something that you wear on your feet and you put them on before your shoes. They come in sets of two. Socks, socks, you got it. And let's see what's next. Oh, we we're talking about these animals. They live up in the Arctic. And they start with an S. They love to swim. Seals, seals, seals. Oh, and here's another animal that lives in the water. They live in the sea and they're very little. They have a second part of their name that likes to gallop. This is a the horse, the horse that starts with an S. And then we have oh, something that you can put your groceries in. You buy things at the store, you might put them in a paper sack, a paper sack. There it is, a paper sack. And what else do we have here? Oh, we just talked about these. These are pictures of the Seals, a seal swimming in the water. And ooh, more. This looks like maybe sea lions, all in a great big mob of sea lions. Look at all of those. Looks like there's hundreds of them. Hundreds of them. And that might be a sea lion family right there together. And what else do we have? Oh, even more. Look at all of them right there. The sea lions. There is a place on the Oregon coast called the Sea Lion Cave. And you can go down in a cave and it opens up to the home of hundreds, if not thousands of sea lions. And they're down there barking. Sea lions sound like they're barking when they're talking. It is so loud when you go down the cave and it opens up to see all of the sea lions. It's an amazing place to go to. The sea lion caves on the Oregon coast. And I have some more cards. Oh, this is a tool that you can use to cut something. Maybe cut wood, cut logs with a saw, a saw. And then we have something that warms us during the day. It gives us light during the day. The sun, the sun, the nice sunshine. And let's see what else we have. Oh, we have a book that we might read in our next lesson. And we do have some words here. We might try to see if we can read some of these words. And they have three letters in them. The beginning two letters are the blends. So how about we look at our blends first over here on our easel. We move our poster and we'll say some F blends. What is that Sammy Seal right there? Do you see Sammy Seal? He's gonna help us with our S blends. S-A. So you just say the two sounds and then put them together to make the blend. Ah, ah, sa, sa. Start thinking of some words that could go with sa. Eh, eh, se, se, se. Ooh, I can already think of some letters I could add to the end of that to make a word. And si, 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 si. Ah, ah, 
saw, saw. The last one, sa, uh, sa, sa, sa. Oh, I think I know what that word could be. Do you think it could be this word? Let's find out if we can turn those into words. So if we have S-A and then we add a T, fat, fat. I sat in the chair, fat, fat. Okay, what's next? Set, 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 set. I set the table for dinner, set. What else do we have? S I sit, 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 sit. We sit up straight when we're at school at our tables. Sit. We sit straight and tall. Sit, sit. And then, oh, here's that easy one. It keeps us warm. Sun, 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 sun. Oh, here's one. We haven't really talked about this letter, but maybe we could figure it out. Six, X, six, 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 six. The number six. Oh, and there's a big word. Uh, mm, I wrote this really big. Some, some, some. That's the total of a math equation, a sum, sum. Oh, and this is a name. We might could read this one. Seth, mm, Seth, mm. That's our seal's name, Sam. And I like to call him Sammy, Sammy Seal. And this says Sam, Sam. And that takes us back to fat, fat. So now let's find out how we are going to write our letter F. So I'm going to get out my writing paper and you should have this too. This week, you should be getting this paper. It's page 43 and 44 for our writing. And we're going to practice our S's. So the S's are kind of curvy. So we have to get ready to make some curves. And we need So you will practice our essays. So let me get my dry erase. And when we make an F, we can see right here that the capital S is upstairs and downstairs. Did he go in the basement? He almost went in the basement when he came off of the belt, but he really does not go in the basement. Okay, so he stays upstairs and downstairs. And his little buddy, lowercase s, he is just downstairs. He's not upstairs, he's not in the basement. He is a little guy. So our capital S is going to go around. And then you're going to go backwards around, kind of like you're kicking up and giving him a tail. So you're going to start out by going around, kind of like a C, kind of like you're making a C. And then you're just going to turn directions and go backwards and kind of give him a tail. So he has a frontwards S or a frontwards C and then a backwards C, kind of like you're giving him a tail. Or capital S. And little s is the same way, but you're just making him smaller so that he just stays downstairs. Let's look at our paper. We'll bring it back up. And on my paper today, I'm going to practice my S's around, down, and tail. Around, down, and tail. Around, down, and tail. There's my little s. And little s's. And then I'm going to do capital S's, around, down, and a tail. And I'm going to go in this empty space, and I'm going to practice my S's by myself there. So I trace and I move over here, and I make some S's all by myself. And then I'm going to circle the pictures that begin with the sound of S. So 
So do you think that you will circle? So six, about hat, hat, is it a sat? No, that's a picture of a hat, about saw. Kind of sounds like it to me. Sun and seal, which ones of those are you going to circle? You do your writing paper, and then come back together with Miss Kelly in the afternoon and we'll see which ones were correct. And then when you do the back of your paper, I see a sailboat and a sun. Oh, and I see a blend, suh, suh. So you're gonna write the blend, suh, suh. In the empty space, you'll write suh. And you're going to practice your lowercase s's and your uppercase s's. And you'll make some of those in the empty space. And then it says, circle the blend that you hear in the word sun. Now remember, the blend is just the first two letters. We're talking about beginning blends, the first two letters. So you just circle the first two letters in the word sun. And then see if you can find those S's that are hiding in the waves underneath the sailboat. Oh, and there's a message from God. God made the wind to blow the sail. Yes, the wind is what blows the sailboats. They don't even need a motor. God's wind blows the sailboats across the water. God made the wind to blow the sail. So you can. Practice your S's today and circle the correct pictures and we'll come back together and check our paper. So I will see you in a little while and we'll check all of our practice. Bye-bye.